What's good? It's Chagosi. It's Saturday, May 26, 2018. And see this gentleman on the right in this picture? This is a theatrical stage performer. He is an actor. He participates in fake news propaganda. He goes by the name of Moon J.N. You know, goes, goes without saying, he's a character actor playing the role of the moon in this ongoing Saturn Sun time moon ritual. Donald Trump playing the role of Saturn to keep her time, obviously. Moon and Gematria equals 21. So he is the 12th and current president of South Korea. 12, the reflection of 21. Moon, JN, you see, 21, full reduction, reversing, reflecting that, he's a 12. His name sums to 42, that same full reduction. So M is the 13th letter, 1 plus 3 is 4, O is the 15th, 1 plus 5 is 6. Add them all, get 42. Moon, JN, this character actor, you know, born in 53, North Korea, 53. So from his 65th birthday, to this surprise meeting, it's not a surprise at all because it's all scripted theater from the federal government. Moon J N forty two from his January twenty fourth birthday, so twenty fourth reflection of forty two. He's born on twenty fourth. To today is four months two days. So his name sums to forty two, participating in a surprise meeting. Four months two days later on a date with a life lesson number of 42. <laughs> so do you understand how he is nothing else than an actor employed by the Scottish Rite Freemasons doing what he's told to do by the numbers? So this is the life lesson number 5 plus 26 plus 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 8 gives you 42. And all these 42s we're seeing, again, they're the numbers for Saturn, 42. Freemason, 42. I mean, just to see, Moon JN and Freemason have the same gematria. Just, just, just so we can all get up to speed, because he is a Freemason, he is an actor participating in Zionist Jew false propaganda. So that's. I just want to open up with that example. But of course, there's always more. There's some more things that I saw in this piece of property again. So again, this is what? North Korea propaganda. But we're talking about the two Koreas, which is just one Korea. There's no such thing as North and South Korea. It's just Korea, which is just a branch of the federal government. Look, Saturn right here. Sun, moon. Ritual. But anyway, see how Korea is doing this? Korea equals 31. It's a date with 31 numerology, 5 plus 26. Reversing the alphabetical order and then reducing each to a single digit. So do you understand how they're making sure in this date they're doing this propaganda? So, if that wasn't enough, Check out my last video. We saw some North Korean propaganda with the minute 54 second video. That is 114 seconds, World War 114. But what I'm trying to drive home is we saw how they had the 154 just yesterday inside the video length. Now they're updating this piece of Korean propaganda at 1054. They're doing it again. And again, sun equals 54. This is a Saturn Sun Moon ritual. Again, this character actor's name is Moon. I, I just, I don't, I don't think I need to talk about how he's just an actor for the federal government. The two, these two actors, exchange their opinions. 
exchanged their opinions. They did not. They exchanged scripts. Exchange their opinions equals 125 in full reduction. See, we've been using this full reduction the whole time. 125. That is number four again. North Korea. North Korea, 125. And that's why then we have a surprise meeting, 125. 55. So that's what I'm saying when I say, like, there's a reason why in the script that was scripted decades in advance, they scripted a surprise meeting. They used these keywords, these flavors to sync them up in this propaganda. If North Korea didn't sum to this, we would never have heard propaganda on a surprise meeting because they don't, they don't fit. But you understand then what they're doing inside this propaganda. And again, they, they put that number again right here. And that number is also 242. The synagogue of Satan sums 242, but it's 2442 sequence. Again, this is happening a date with 2442 numerology, Moon Jae in 42, Saturn 42, happening four months, two days from his birthday, and they with life lesson number 42. So, and one on is the 29th prime. Prophecy 29, Masonic 29. Look, we even have the Saturnian actor chiming in. 737. 37 is the 12th prime. Again, we're talking about the 12th and current character actor of South Korea. So if you're from South Korea and you're watching my video, I'm telling you right now, this is not your president. He is a theatrical actor all he does is do what he's told to do and participates in false flag zionist jew propaganda i've never been a korean in my life i'm sitting here confidently telling you this man is an actor he's not your president whatsoever you know that's why he assumed office five slash one federal 51 conspiracy 51 now he's doing this priest propaganda and with 51 numerology you can just see it's the same numbers throughout this propaganda. So, you know, Donald Trump, 737. Saturn, 21, 37, the reflection of 12. Well, 37 is the 12th prime, 12 the reflection of 21. But you see how they're giving you 73, 37. 73 is the 21st prime. That's why, what's his name? Shelton. Sheldon from The Big Bang Theory loves 73. Because it's the 21st prime and it's reflection 37, it's the 12th prime, and you know, NASA, Mason, 30, you know, Mason 73, NASA 73, you know, plenty more of that number. Saturn equals 73 in ALW Kabbalah. And here we have this actor telling you. If it does happen, we'll likely remain in Singapore on the same date. June 12th, that's 1, 2, slash 6. If you write out 45, you get 126. And we have, ooh, Mr. 45, the Saturnian actor, 45, the Summer Static Max Square, giving you this propaganda. Do you understand what I mean? Like, I, I point out these patterns, and here we have Donald Trump just giving us another example. You know, 71, the 20th prime, time 20, Catholic 71. He's currently 71 right now. U.S. officials said the final straw came when a North Korean foreign ministry official, so just an actor for the federal government, called Vice President Mike Pence a political dummy. So Mike Pence is the Vice President of the United States of America in the narrative, but in reality, he's just another actor doing what he's told to do. 25. So I'm trying to see the pattern here. Here we have the 40th prime right here. 25, death 25, murder 79. But I want to fully see the, see the context before I start pinning, you know, what they're saying. But then... Pyongyang. Pyongyang equals 52, like government. So here we have 21, 50, 
See, these are numbers for Saturn and Moon. Saturn 21, Saturn 69, Moon 57 reflection, Moon 21. Oh, again, of course, this is happening today on a Saturday. They're doing this Saturnian ritual, all these 42s, seeking up with Moon JN. I mean, it's just extremely easy to see. That's why I say it's so easy to see. Why do you think I say it's easy to see? Because his name is Moon. You know, those parts of the videos where I can't get over. You know, I've, I've known his name for a while, but I just don't know why I don't point it out more. Maybe because it goes, guys, his name is Moon. <laughs> Saturn 30, 30 minutes. Oh, yeah, Kim equals 33, 1521. Like, see, moon, 1521, Kim and moon. <laughs> Kim and moon. See, Kim and moon. So pretty much 1521 15, and 1521. See? And see how they neatly lay it out? Kim, full reduction is 15. Moon is 21, full reduction. Reversing now, Kim is 21, Moon is 15. See how they're really trying to pair this really hard. And of course, Kim with the World War numbers or yeah, World War 48, like Kim. World War 42, like all these 42s are put in today. But remember, Kim Jong-un, some say the same thing as World War. I mean, same, okay, Kim Jong-un also some say 42. But again, it goes without saying. We don't even need to talk about Kim Jong-un much because we already do. And I'm just trying to show you how the South Korean president is also a fake news actor. I mean, obviously, if he's doing what this, we've already proven how Kim Jong-un is just a fake news play, playwright. So, I mean, there you have it. Kim and Moon, some of the same thing. You see they neatly laid it out. See, remember the armistice was signed in 1953 and then they did that peace treaty they had. That I, I didn't specifically say what they're going to do, but I said, look up this day. Korea's going to do some crazy in the propaganda, and they do. And again, signed in 1953. Moon Jae-in born in 53 because they're actors participating in this North Korean propaganda. North Korea, 53. Korean equals 35, the reflection. Look at this. Is Solo suffering from Star Wars fatigue? Do you see the mocking? I'm sorry. When I first saw the preview of this, I was literally like, another Star Wars movie just already. They're just already putting it out. Of course, they're foreshadowing something. There's something occult behind it. Everything else I talk about here is, you know, true in that. But I'm just going straight up from just, they're putting, they're just pumping out these Star Wars movies left and right. And then they're mocking you. Is Solo suffering from Star Wars fatigue? It's stupid. Up to 11.52, Prophecy 52, Government 52, Mark Hamill in denial about Luke Skywalker. Just see what in denial sounds to you. I, you know, I don't mean to trick the the USA 41, the 13th the Prime. So Star Wars numbers, all I know they have is 47 with S exceptions. You know, we could probably talk about this later. I don't, I don't mean to back to track off, but I like to you know look at other pieces pieces of propaganda. But look, we we can we can still be on topic. Look at this. So what have we been talking about in this entire video? Kim equals forty two. No, nope, forty eight. But Kim Jong Un equals forty two, right? Kim Jong Un forty two, World War forty two, Moon J N forty two. Today's date with a life lesson number 42. All these 42s are saying 42 from his birthday. Freemason equals 42. So I'm saying all this then. We're on another piece of propaganda. And look at this. Three minute, one second video. That's 181 seconds. 181 is the 40 second prime number. So... It's this point in the video where I'm always like, I'm so glad I got sidetracked and clicked on that because the entire point of my channel 
is to educate anyone and everyone as to how everything in the news is fake news, Zionist Jew propaganda by the same numbers. And they put the 40 second prime rent then in the seconds in that video. Freemason, 42, Zionism, 42, Jesuit, 42. And who who's putting on this propaganda? The Freemasons, the Zionist Jews, and the Jesuit order. And they all send the 42, polluting this piece of propaganda and the Korean propaganda with the number 42. You know, gas prices are up 31% from last Memorial Day on a date with 31 numerology. And I'm glad we saw that because I wanted to point this out. Assassination, 611 in Jewish Gematria. Do you understand how this is all rigged? Hitting the road, this will likely Guys, be the most expensive summer driving season see? in years. In years, they're saying all this, but look, oil is selling off. That's what I'm saying. Oil is selling off. I might have to restart this, but see, it's sixty-seven fifty. It was seventy-two dollars not long ago, so it went all the way up to seventy-two. This was the old ticket before it expired, but you can see how it was seventy-two. It was even higher. It's been selling off for the past few days, and gas is still up and rising. Because they don't expect the common goyim to follow the price of oil like that and, and understand. So they're going to keep nickel and diming you at the pump. Why? Because these are Zionist Jews. These are Freemasons. That's how they operate. They're greedy. They don't give a shit about you. You know, USA 41, 41 the 13th prime, in denial equals 41 as they're coding inside. See, that's why I'm glad to click on that piece. In Denial 41, now they have 41 and this piece of propaganda about gas prices, 41 second video. It's a prime number, it's the 13th prime. America found with the 13 stripes on their flag, the 13 colonies, the Berlin Illuminati founded with the 13 families. If you're out 13, you get 99. They're founded with 99 numerology. Also, Derek Jeter rookie card sells for 99.1K. 199 in reflections, the 46 prime. That's all I can see right now. Bleacher Report, they don't have much numbers in their propaganda. Look at this. Wow. This is clear. Oh my goodness. I just cannot believe this. I have a video up about Sixto Sanchez and then calling him a nigger because they talk about his 102 mile per hour fast fastball. So, again now. You know, I might just have to make a second video talking about the same thing because someone, people are saying, oh, no, everything's racist. Someone idiot commented in that video saying I'm looking in too much on shit. Look, they're doing it again. A Negro, a nigger, see? If, it, again, if we got something like this with a white person on here, I would completely apologize and admit that, okay, they're probably saying something else. You know, they're not really being racist. I would be humble and say that, but I can't. Give you that example with Sixto Sanchez. If you're new here, watch my Sixto Sanchez video to search Sixto Sanchez. See, I talked about the same thing. You see in the same exact column, the same spot on the main software user interface of this propaganda application, CNN. We get 102 mile, mile per hour fastball with another black man throwing it. Nigger 102. Sixto Sanchez with the 102. I mean, you have to understand that, <laughs> I mean, this seals the deal. They can't do it again with another black person, 61 to 18th prime, race 18. They can't do it again with another black person. And then you say it's coincidence. They're not being racist. No, they're literally doing it again. The same numbers, the same 102 mile per hour fastball. It's clearly a running inside joke from the MLB. Irish strongly in favor of ending abortion ban. Updated at 826, coming on the 26th day of May. Killed 26. Sacrifice 62, the reflection. Mason 26. I don't know what Ireland sums to. But again, I like to type these things in because then we can see. You know, and it doesn't have to sum to 26. Ireland 126. Well, okay. 
the Kia David, 216-6363. You know, I'm trying to give you that trope inside the name of Ireland. Revelation 49, four minute, nine second video. But there you have it. I'm just going to end here, make this nice 20 minute video. Possibly make, I mean, I might as well just make another quick video. It'll be like two minutes at most just showing this because it needs to be seen, these two patterns at the same time. So I'm just going to end now so I can get to that and get to other videos today. But I had to document this 42 coding. Just, just a recap. If there's a lot of information for you, his name is 42 His name is 42 World War is 42 Today's the date with a life lesson number 42. Four months, two days from his, his birthday. And plenty more we've seen. And look, 11.33. I mean, I love when we see the 33s because everyone, no, no matter what level you're on of understanding this, we all understand that 33 is the number for the Freemasons, Donald Trump. Playing the 44th King of Israel, the 44th person to be president, up to 11, 40, 33, but 11 plus 33 is 44. Trump sustained attacks on American rights, you know, kill 44. Attack number, destructive number, T Shabab number 134. See? Pairing this 134, T Shabab destructive number, murder 34, with the 44. And of course, they're getting us to you with 11, 33. And who is Chris Cuomo? giving you some false flag propaganda. What if I said, whenever you see Chris Cuomo, whenever you see Jake Tapper, every last verb, every last noun, every last adjective that comes from their mouth is a lie instructed to them to put on by the Freemasons, the Zionist Jews, and the Jesuit order. NFL policy requiring players to stand during the national anthem if they are on the field or they face a fine. But guess what? There are going to be so many now black athletes still taking the fine. Oh, I make all this money. I'm just going to take the fine anyway. I mean, that's that's the narrative. That's the type of propaganda they're going to give you then. You know, people will still defy that rule because why are they going to defy the rule? They're instructed to defy it. The NFL specifically tells which black people are not supposed to stand for national anthem at which times. Why? Because football is a theatrical stage performance put on by the federal government. Colin Kaepernick is just an actor doing what he's told to do. And here's Chris Cuomo lying to you, telling you how the NFL is putting on a rule and all this. No. Mexican. See, Mexican Mexican equals 33. Mexico equals 33. Updating is 1133. You know, fake news propaganda by the numbers. You know, Mexico, Mexico equals 93, 30, 69, like Saturn. No wonder Donald Trump has such an affinity with Mexico. I mean, I honestly never even knew that part. But that's what I'm saying. You can say Donald Trump, the Mexicans, all this. You want to understand exactly why the occult reason behind it. It's all this Saturnian ritual featuring the Saturnian actor, Mr. 45, clicking the sum of Saturn's land square. Get nothing else than an array of Donald Trump propaganda. Look, you even have this Mr. 42 as well. Kim Jong-un, this other theatrical performer. Sitting right here. Trump says spies in campaign will be unprecedented. Spies 41, it's not 41. Spies 31, yes, they have 31 numerology. Korea equals 31, North Korea 23. See? My favorite number for this, North Korea 20. No, North Korea's not 23, excuse me. Korea 23. But it's that same pattern. You know, Korea 5023, Donald 5023, Korea 2331. They were 31 numerologies, plans, propaganda, spies, you know. And again, this is the fake news narrative. We know about Trump's business empire. Guys, he's not a businessman. He never was. He is an actor participating in Zionist Jew propaganda. Part of his role is was to be a businessman and own real estate and all this. That's part of the role. But in reality, is doing what he's told to do. If you're a businessman because you're literally told by your employers to do it and put on a big show and act, I mean, you're really just an actor. Maybe you shouldn't be in the country. No, if guys, you, guys, you should never sing the Star Spangled Banner. Sing this two two three coded. 
Piece of shit. Star Spangled Banner, 190, 223, the Star Spangled Banner, like Synagogue of Satan. You see what I'm saying? Why does why does why does the national anthem for America <laughs> and the synagogue of Satan <laughs> share Gematria? It's just unbelievable. I tell you how your the federal government is a synagogue of Satan. Just just take one hard look at this. That is what I'm saying. This is what you live in. You live in the synagogue of Satan's country, the synagogue of Satan's territory. If you're from France, if you're from Germany, England, the Star Spangled Banner is your national anthem as well. And you do not have to sing it. You should not sing it. It's a piece of shit. Mind control tune crafted by the federal government, by the numbers. You know, Francis Scott Key, <laughs> the Key of David. I mean, his name is Francis Scott Key making the song per the narrative. This this guy, guys, Francis Scott Key is nothing else than a Freemason participating in false flag Zionist Jew propaganda. That's all he is. He's an actor doing what he's told to do by his Scottish Rite Freemasonic employers. Notice how he was born in the 1700s, died in 1843, and I'm talking about him just like I talk about this actor, these group of actors here. It's the same exact thing. You know? Francis Scott Key. Well, come on. Key 13. Or no. Key 13, yeah. Key 13 and 41. 41's the 13th prime. You know, the 13 stripes and the Star Spangled Banner with the 13 colonies. His name sums to 188, like Bavarian Illuminati, Mason 62. Because Francis Scott Key is an actor for the Bavarian Illuminati. That is it. That's why Bavarian Illuminati equals 188, 180, like Francis Scott Key, or 188, 80. He is an actor for the Bavarian Illuminati. Cannot stress it enough. He was murdered by the numbers, you know, 43, murder 43, died in 111. Oops. You can just, and this is how you, like, people wonder, like, are these people Freemasons? Are they this? Just look at this, just look at the name numerology and look at the date they died. You know, kill 6428, Mason 2873, <laughs> Synagogue of Satan 64. Look, he's literally making the Synagogue of Satan's theme song, dying date with 64 numerology. See, Synagogue of Satan 64. It's, <laughs> it's very clear the type of propaganda that Francis Scott Key participated in. And it's the same type of propaganda right here. These are all, all these people are on the same payroll Francis Scott Key was. All these people are employed by Francis Scott Key's employers. He is nothing else than a co-worker to them. That's all. Kim Jong-un, Moon Jae-in are co-workers to Francis Scott Key. Although, you know, of course, he's dead now. If he, Again, if he even existed, you know what I'm saying? This fictional character possibly even existed. You know, sacrifice 55, dead and with 55 numerology, kill the kill numbers, 64, 28, Mason, they killed the Mason, 73, 28, see, 73, 28, sacrifice 55, he was sacrificed by the federal government because he was an actor for them. With the S exception, S the 19th letter, reduce it once, you get 10, 55. See? Very easy to see. And you might as well see how many days from his upcoming birthday, his upcoming 64th birthday, you know, died at 63. The key of David, 63. Guys, the key of David equals 63. Francis Scott Key dying in, at 63. I mean, the guy was murdered by this code. It's very easy to see. 63 forwards and backwards, dying at 63. See, this video is getting long now, but it's fine. Nice, it'll be a nice half hour video showing how Korea is fake and then how Francis Scott Key is nothing else than an actor for the federal government. So, that January 11th, 1843, born August 1st, you know, Ritual 81. 
So we'll see from his upcoming 64th birthday. When when was he ritualistically sacrificed? 202 days. 22 is the master builder number. The master builder. This guy literally crafted the national anthem according to this false flag fake news narrative. Then we can see from his 63rd birthday to the day he died. Hundred and sixty three days. <laughs> One sixty three is the thirty eighth prime. I mean honestly when I was gonna type his birth numerology in or excuse me, his death numerology, I was thinking, okay, we're gonna find some thirty eight somewhere. And we found it. He dies hundred and sixty three days from his sixty third birthday. That's the thirty eighth prime. Death killing murder equals thirty eight. Cancel equals 38. His life was canceled by the federal government. His role as an actor was canceled by the federal government. Canceled 38. He was erased. You know, too bad he wasn't erased from history. He was ejected. 38. Death. 38. Killing. 38. Murder. 38. Destroy. 38. Plenty more. And then the 100. And the, again, what's the 38th prime? 163. It's always primary relationships with the federal government. 163 days later, he's dead. You know, also five months, 10 days, Conspiracy 51, Federal 51, you know, federal government branding the propaganda. All he is is nothing else than propaganda from them. This, this hidden hand. I mean, guys, this, he's even doing the hidden hand. I mean, he's not putting it in the front of his coat. He's putting it in his pocket. Wait. I mean, it doesn't matter where he's putting it. He's clearly doing the hidden hand. I mean, what else do you need to see? This guy was a 33rd degree master Freemason. <laughs> participating in Zionist Jew propaganda. No. <laughs> oh my goodness. He, <laughs> he was born on a date with a <laughs> a lifeless number of 33 <laughs> and 105 numerology. 105 numerology. Masonry, 33, what a f <laughs> Guys, do you understand how he's nothing else than an actor for the Scottish Rite Freemasons? We're, we're seeing all this, again, Mason 7 through 28. We're seeing all this information. I'm literally crying. It's so funny. And then he was born on a date with 33. You understand why I'm laughing? It's always a joke from the federal government. Jewish 88, time number. The Kia David and Francis Bacon equals 213. He was born on the 213th day of the year, dying in 63, or dying at 63. I mean, it's just so clear, this guy. And his name is Francis Scott Key. I mean, you could see the riddle that they're doing. Francis Scott Key, dying at 63 on the 213th day of the year he was born. Unbelievable. Francis 119, I mean, come on, the guy's name sums to you 119, his first name, Freemason 96, his first name sums to you 47, I mean, of course, Scott, too, they love the number Scott, or they love the name Scott as well, Scott 58, you know, think about it. Scott, Scottish Rite Freemasons, see, these, Scot <laughs> these Scottish Rite Freemasons branding this actor, <laughs> oh my goodness, Scottish 103 as well, see, Scott 58, like Freemasonry. Scott 5877, like Rosicrucian. See? Rose Cross 58. Again, Freemasonry 58. His middle name, something 58. Then again, Key 67 in Francis Bacon. Freemasonry 67. 41 to 13th Prime. I mean, I'm just going over this. So this video turned to something different, but look at this. Of course, he died in Baltimore. Oh, yeah. During that whole... You know, screw the narrative. But, again, Baltimore, Maryland is a Zionist Jew place. Dying in Baltimore, 41, 58. I mean, come on. Key, 41. Scott, 58. Freemasonry, 58, 59. 
Revelation 121, the key David from the book of Revelation, dying in Baltimore, Maryland. Baltimore MD 190, like the start, like Star Spangled Banner, 49, like Revelation, Masonry 105, New World Order 75, Francis Scott Key is an actor for the New World Order, participating in New World Order propaganda. So I really hope we all see this. I mean, for people asking that, is this person a Freemason, that person a Freemason, you see what, how we just broke down Francis Scott Key. We didn't even get past the first part of the of the thing. You can decode the rest of this, find out how it's all by the numbers. You know, President Jackson nominated Key for the United States Attorney for the District of Columbia in 1833. So what does that tell you? President Jackson, Andrew Jackson is nothing else than an actor for the federal government. That nomination was a ritual put on by the numbers. That is what I'm saying. Andrew Jackson was never a president. He is a character actor playing the role of the president of the United States of America, the seventh president. He was born and died by the numbers, you know, blood sacrifice 86, <laughs> ritualistically sacrificed 8 slash 6. Mason 17, born 153, 15 slash 3. The 17th Strangler number in 67, in 1767, Freemasonry 67, Mason 17. You know, died at 78 years old, Scottish Rite 78. And then you can see the day he died. Andrew Jackson died June 8th, 1845. June 8th, 1845. Date with 59 numerology. Scottish Rite 159, Kill 59. Scottish 32, DC on the 77th Meridian, Judaism 77, Rosicrucian 77, killed 26, dying a day with 206 days remaining. And then you see March 15th, 1767. See? Masonry, Zionism, Federal 39. This federal government actor, Andrew Jackson, <laughs> born a date with 39 life lesson number. Federal government equals 85, the reflection of 58. Look, guys, he was born a date with 93 and 30 numerology. Saturn, 93, 30. He was born the 74th day of the year. Masonic, 74. Guys, you see how easy it is. All you need is a birth and death numerology. And you can see how it's all, these are all a bunch of actors for the federal government. They're all Freemasons putting on fake news propaganda. That's all Andrew Jackson did. He participated in fake news, false flag, Zionist Jew theater. So we can see from March 15th, seven, uh, 1845, the day he died. And he died 6 slash 8, <laughs> pillar 68. 85 days from his birthday. So born on date with 85 numerology, dying 85 days. But look at this. Revelation 121, blood sacrifice equals 121 in 86. So Andrew Jackson dying 12 weeks in one day, exactly, including the end date, a span of 86 days from his birthday on 8 slash 6 in most parts of the world. You see, just like how Moon Jae in with the 42, doing a date with 42 numerology, Four months, two days from his birthday. Now, 86 days from his birthday on 8 slash 6, Andrew Jackson is dying. That's also a span of 1, 2, 2. Freemason, 1, 2, 2. 12 weeks, 2 days. Blood, sacrifice, equals 86, 1, 2, 1. Do you see? So, in 67. It was Freemason born in 67. But anyway, do you understand? We, we see Andrew Jackson, how he's died by the numbers. We see Francis Scott Key, how he, was died, how he died by the numbers. You see how easy it is to just put in some numerology, see how many dates it's from, and it's the same pattern again and again throughout the Zionist Jew propaganda. Andrew Jackson equals 213. I mean, we're talking about his numbers. He dies at 78. His name sums to 78. See, Andrew Jackson dies at 78 years old. The Scottish Rite Freemason, Scottish Rite 78, Jesuit 78, 
wearing red and black, the Jesuit orders colors, because he's nothing else than a Jesuit. He's an actor for the Jesuit order. <laughs> so they got to say it again, 190, Freemason 48, Federal 138. That's a federal government employee. That's it. Again, Federal 39, born of a lifeless number 39, Masonry 39, designed as 39. So I hope everyone's following. Like, these examples are just so clear. And you see how easy it is to do. I'm not anything special. I'm not doing anything out of the ordinary. I'm on the propaganda software application, Wikipedia, and see how they're giving us carefully crafted, created propaganda. All Andrew Jackson is is a bunch of propaganda. That's all he was. All he ever was, possibly. Everything he did was by the by the numbers. This whole thing is a play. He was told to do it. Everything he participated in was a play. Just like Barack Obama, Donald Trump. You, you see how I talk about Obama and Trump. So why would you possibly think that Andrew Jackson's any different? Always flying the Jesuit orders colors. I mean, this guy is disgusting. This guy's always putting this red and black nonsense. <laughs> You know, proudly flying this, this gang's colors. This hidden hand, look at this shit. That is a Freemason just mocking you by the code. Oh, the Founding Fathers, respect. No, guys, fuck Andrew Jackson. He's a piece of shit. A Grandmaster Deceiver. I mean, guys, yeah, if you're new, if you're unfamiliar, guys, if you've seen American Money, this is the asshole on the $20 bill. This is the piece of shit Freemasonic, Freemasonic tyrant with this Phoenix next to him. On the 20 about look, 159, the note 159 on here. Scottish right 159. He died in the 159th day of the year. You see that? Murdered in the 159th day of the year. And then, and then on this piece of propaganda, Wikipedia makes sure to give us the picture with this 159 right here. United States of America 228. He's the president of the United States of America. What a piece of shit. If you have a $20 bill, next time you spend it, Think about the piece of shit tyrant who was ruling over you, you know, doing what his employer is telling, telling him to do. Jackson sought to advance the rights of the common man against a corrupt aristocracy and to preserve the union. What a load of bullshit. All this guy did is do what his Zionist Jew employers tell him what to do. He did what the Jesuit order tells him what to do. They told him to have this type of edge on the people. It's a bunch, literally a bunch of propaganda. The guy didn't give a shit about the common man. He didn't give a fuck about anybody. But his employers, his Freemasonic Scottish Rite buddies up in their lodge. So I hope you see how these are just a bunch of tyrants. How all presidents are fake news actors. And how all they do is participate in Zionist Jew, Masonic order within the Catholic Church, Scottish Rite Freemasonic propaganda. Again, Scottish Rite 78. Jesuit 78. Why does Jesuit something 78 with the red and black colors? All we do is see Andrew Jackson wearing red and black everywhere. He dies at 78. Same something 78. You know, I'm about to end this video, but there you have it. Another really good video. You got Scotch Wright 159, 78. Dying on the 159th day of the year at 78. And they put the bill with 159 in there. And we're, we're all seeing this. I didn't pre-plan this. I got to him through Francis Scott Key, and that's because we saw them put the Star Spangled Banner in that football NFL propaganda. That's how we got to all of this. So you can see how we can just freestyle through it all. We can coast through it all so easily because it's all coded crap from these Scottish Rite Freemasons. Peace out.